first universe. Welcome to another episode of Robots with the Rockettes. This is Maddie, and today we will be talking about holonomic drivetrains. A holonomic drivetrain is usually one with either all omni wheels or mechanism wheels. Here is a simple one we built over the summer. It uses the leftover bot control system we described in our first episode, with one omni wheel at each corner of the robot that we built out of Lexan and Actobotics motor mounts. Omni wheels have small rollers on them that let the main wheel slide sideways with little friction. Thanks to the lazy bots for the inspiration. Holonomic drives have the advantage of usually being speedy and that they can move in any direction without turning. However, you probably don't want to use one in a pushing match or for climbing ramps because they don't have very good traction. Omni wheels may also build up electrostatic discharge, which can disable your electronics. One version has wheels placed diagonally at all four corners of the robot. When all four wheels spin in the direction you want to move, the inward and outward motion vectors cancel each other out, and you are left with a robot that can drive the direction your joystick moves. Let's take a look at the source code. Up here is where we get our motors from the hardware map. Then down here, we read our joysticks. The interesting thing about the joysticks is that our left joystick controls the holonomic drive's movement and the right joystick controls like if you wanted to just spin in circle. For that one, it tells all the motors to have the same speed, so it just goes in circles. Here, we take the data from the joysticks and here is where we set the power to each motor. All of our code will be on GitHub if you guys want to try this for yourselves. That's all. Bye bot buddies!